This is the next in a series of my presidential addresses, my presidential minute to the membership. Um, today we're going to talk about SB 492, uh, our bill in the state senate to redefine optometry for here in California. As you recall, this bill has two components to it. The first part of the bill is the primary care component where doctors of optometry along with nurse practitioners and pharmacists in a coordinated attempt will help to bridge the provider gap of primary care physicians and the shortage that is coming in 2014. The second part of the bill is an expansion of scope of what doctors of optometry here in California can do in their practices. These expanded guidelines will help us provide better care to our members, more accessible care to our members, without lots and lots of restrictions on procedures and drugs and diseases that we can manage. The first thing you can do is engage in social media and also with the news articles online and comment appropriately when you see something that you like or when you see something that you don't like. So the second thing you can do is to continue to build relationships with your local legislator. Nothing is more important and more vital to our cause that when that legislator has a question about a bill on optometry that they call their local optometrist. And that would be great if that was a California Optometric Association member. And the third thing is please be attuned to emails that come from the association when we send you a key person advocacy alert. And that's an action that we need you to take in a very timely manner. It might be just an email or a phone call or a letter. Passing legislation in Sacramento is never easy. We have opponents out there that want to beat us and that's why it's so important that we stick together as we advocate for the profession. Please keep up the outstanding work. Together we can be successful. Thank you all very much.